It's not grace plus tongues. It's not faith plus tongues. It's not faith plus baptism. You know, that's another one that's becoming more and more common. Oh, if you're not baptized, you're not saved. This uh, salvation is by grace alone, through faith alone, in Christ alone. He was on his way back home. Years earlier, he left home with his stash of cash, planning to live on the wild side. He did it all, wine, woman, and song. But after a while, the money ran out. And this Jewish boy, he found a job feeding the non kosher you know, he had to deal with these non-kosher pigs. And this, this Jewish boy, he's now fighting the pigs for some of the food. This rich kid, he probably left home in his Ferrari. He was broke. He was bankrupt. He had nothing. He was dirty. He was smelly. He was with the pigs. He had hit bottom. That's when he came to his senses. Oh, the story in the Bible, we come and call it the prodigal son. He said, I'm going to go home. He says, I'm going to tell dad. I'm going to tell dad. He, he prepared his speech. I'm going to go home and I'm going to say to, to dad. I'm going to, I'm going to say, dad. I, 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 I have sinned against heaven and, and I've sinned against you and I'm no more worthy to be called your son. Make me just a servant. Got up on me. I don't know if he had a sack. He was making his way home. He had to hoof it. Probably bummed a ride here and there. His speech was well rehearsed. But when he was still a far way off, his dad saw him. Dad had been looking for him. You see, dad had wanted to feel him in his embrace. Dad ran after him. Poor boy was shocked. He thought he was going to get a tongue lashing. But no. Dad hugged him despite his smell. Dad hugged him. The boy started his speech. Father, I have sinned against heaven. And. And grace stepped in. Your Bible. The prepared speech never got given. Dad stopped him before he could ever say, Make me a servant. Dad, once he heard, I have sinned. I'm no more. Took off the robe. He took his robe and he robed this smelly boy. That's what God did for me. I was messed up. He clothed me with his righteousness. He took off his ring. He said, boy, you're worth something. This ring speaks of position. You're the king's kid. He says, dad said, get the fatted calf. Let's kill it. Let's eat. My boy was dead. But he's home. I'm so glad. Jesus.
Jesus has saved me. You might be here. Make sure that you receive his salvation. I want to talk to somebody though. Because something in my heart tells me there might be a prodigal. A Christian prodigal. A Christian who ain't walking straight. Not everybody knows. But God knows. And he's here with his arms open. And God says, come. From faith to faith, the just shall live by his faith. You've trusted Christ already. Some of you need to do business with God right now. God, I'm saved, but my life is a mess. God, I'm saved, but I'm on the bench. Talk to him now. Every head bowed, every eye closed. I give you 30 seconds to talk to God on your own. Do business with God in this minute. Let him know you are so in love with him like you have never been in love with him before and thank him for clothing you with his righteousness. God, we bless you. Thank you for loving wretches like us and for what you have made us. In Jesus' name.